respected principal honorable chief guest teachers parents and all my dear friends good morning to one and all today we are gathered here for the inauguration ceremony of our english club and i feel in need happy and proud to welcome you all this function one song can change a moment one idea can change a world one step can start a journey but a prayer can change the impossible let's start in the day with a prayer everything i am everything i am everything i be everything i be i give it to you lord i give it to you lord and to you thankfully thankfully may i invite our club secretary kumari srinanda for the welcome speech srinanda please good morning to one and all i am indeed happy to get this opportunity to welcome you all to this function first of all let me welcome our chief guest to the day mrs shukla datta ma'am retired primary teacher of one of the most renowned educational institution kendriya Yalaya Sangatan. We are grateful to her for accepting our invitation and become a part of today's event. Welcome, ma'am. Next, I would like to welcome our respected HM Mrs. P. Kylie, ma'am, who is the backbone of our school. Welcome, ma'am. Now, with immense admiration, let me welcome our club convener, Mr. A. B. Sandosh Kumar, sir, to this function. Next, I would like to welcome all the teachers, parents, and my dear friends present here to this function. We all know that we have an English club to showcase our talent. Vibe Cups English Club. Vibe means energy, attitude, impress, etc. C U P S Cups. We use this acronym for Central Upper Primary School. So in Vibe Cups, we get ourselves energized. Welcome all. Thank you. Thank you, Srinanda. Let me now request our club president, Kumar Shreya, for the presidential address. Shreya, please. Good morning, all. I am Shreya of the class 7th B. On this occasion, I stand before you with extreme pleasure to be the president of this club. We are conducting a number of activities to acquire English. I am extremely happy to announce that we will be launching a new English Fest soon. Are you ready for that? So hope you all are ready for the fest. Be active throughout. Thank you. Successful people maintain good habits that go hand in hand. with the success and we have one such person today may i now request our honorable chief guest mrs shukla ma'am to address the gathering and inaugurate the function 
Mrs. Shukla Datta was the headmistress in charge in two schools, Kendra Vidyalaya NEG and Kendra Vidyalaya NAL Bangalore. A very talented teacher, she had spent imparting the right knowledge and skills onto the students appropriately. She is sincere, responsible, well respected and highly esteemed in the teaching profession and students would wait for her class because they knew it will be innovative activity oriented class. She was a resource person for primary teachers in survey schools and also for the induction course for primary teachers. A multi-talented teacher who has worn many hats as in charge of all departments in her long tenure in Kendra Vidyalaya. She was loved by all students and teachers equally and we feel honored to have her in this occasion. Good morning to one and all. Present here at the Udinur Central AUP School. Congratulations on your inauguration. I wish you have a fruitful year ahead. Today, I am going to speak to you on the importance of English language in your daily life. See students, I am sitting in one state. You are in another state, but I am able to comfortably communicate with you. There is a link and the link is the language and the language is English. That is why English is called the link language. Apart from your mother tongue, we need to have a common language which will help us to communicate with anybody anywhere all over the world. And that is the English language. English language is the most commonly spoken language in the world. That is why it is very important to master the English language because effective communication helps in reaching the people faster and better. Now, how do you develop the art of speaking good English? There are four skills. The listening skill, the speaking skill, the reading skill and the writing skill. Listening skill. All of us know we learn after we listen. Listening makes us complete a task by following certain directions. Listening helps us to speak back or to understand what somebody else has spoken. And we are also able to do the assignment assigned to us. You must listen to English to develop your vocabulary and your pronunciation. The more you listen to English, the more you listen to what is being spoken, anywhere and everywhere, it will help you to do the other skills comfortably. Listen to anything, two people talking, you listen to the news, you listen to their accents, you listen to any conversation or a dialogue happening somewhere in English and you will enjoy learning it. Next comes the speaking skill. The speaking skill is a very important skill. Practice makes a man perfect. The more you practice speaking, the more you will perfect the language. Speaking builds confidence and develops fluency. It gets you rid of all the hesitancy and the shyness. The more you speak, what is in your mind, the thoughts, the ideas, it will help you convey your mind, your thoughts to the others. And this will help others to understand you better. You speak single line, you speak about your favorite fruit. You speak on the topics you love or the food you ate. You have to speak at the first instance you are given a chance. Sometimes just self-introduce yourself. You will enjoy speaking in English about yourself, about your people, about your loved ones. Next we have the reading skill. Reading habit is very important to develop vocabulary. I would suggest that you keep a slot, a timing slot 
in your daily schedule where you will do reading read anything that comes in contact with your eyes it can be the headlines of the news stand it can be the headlines of a newspaper magazine a message that that has come a reply to something you have to read when you read a new word you will use the word when you use the word you gain confidence in speaking and that way you will be able to enjoy reading because that will help you learn new words usage of the new words and coming in contact with many more people they will love to listen to you then we have the writing skill regular reading is a stepping stone to developing your writing skill it is a very important platform to communicate english writing is very important you are able to write to anybody all over the world because you are comfortable in writing in english that can be a small message a reply to a message that can be a greeting card a formal letter an informal letter a writing a small sketch a birthday greetings just fill in the blanks write something you are very creative you have just made something some thoughts some ideas put into your writing initially it can be just a scribbling then it will turn into beautiful letters to words which you will enjoy as you grow so the more you write the more you will be able to effectively communicate so please develop your english writing skill by now you have understood english is everywhere the other subjects that you are learning are also in english english is the language of the internet english is a language which you use while you are traveling which makes your travel comfortable english is a language which you will use as your guide for your tourism english is a language you need everywhere for the elementary school children i would like to tell catch them young they have to learn english language play way method it can be they just pick up some word when someone has spoken they use it without any fear without any hesitancy it can be at home it can be in the playground it can be uh, the places where they visit but this develops confidence and this will help them to communicate better with rich vocabulary as they go higher so elementary school english is mandatory they will enjoy the learning process to conclude there is no shortcut to learn anything same is with the english language but i am sure your hard work your love for the language will help you to develop the love of learning english speaking english reading english writing english as you grow big and make a niche for yourself in this world your communication will become easy and you will be a confident citizen of the country i would like to conclude by thanking the organization people others who have invited me to give this small speech thank you i thoroughly enjoyed being with you thank you thank you one and all namaste thank you ma'am certainly your address goes a long way in inspiring us to strive hard and achieve more may i now invite our honorable hm mrs kairali pravangara ma'am for the felicitation speech our respected president our dear chief guest shrimati shukladatta dear colleagues parents and my dear children today is a very special day for all of us our english club's inaugural ceremony happened today in a befitted manner we are lucky enough to get such an eminent personality like shukladatta for our inauguration 
we all know that during this pandemic situation online platforms are helping us to get connected with the students in this digital era we have so much to explore and at the same time have so much of limitations as well but we all should strive really hard to make the impossible to possible as a head of this institution i feel delighted when i see my kids excel in english language our kids are the backbone of this club and i congratulate them all for their great work i would like to congratulate everyone who worked really hard to make english club success and also i wish that english club reaches great heights and keep the great work thank you thank you ma'am may i now invite our subject convener mr av sandosh kumar sir to address us hello everyone hope you all are safe and sound at home we are all waiting for the reopening of uh, the schools because we are all that fed up with uh, those long holidays because of this pandemic we wish to meet our friends we wish to sit with them we wish to play with them we want to do those simple naughty things and what not all of you must be thrilled at the announcement of our respected uh, education minister today that the government is uh, seriously thinking about the reopening of a school in this academic year itself hopefully that will happen sooner than later anyway we are not sitting idle at home as the schools are closed we have digital classes at victors we have online classes through google meet and whatsapp and we are enjoying all those things and uh, we have so many programs and clubs at our school to explore uh, the ability the abilities uh, of us and now we have the english club named why bubbles and this will also help you to explore the various abilities in us various talents in us to showcase these talents teacher they who is there to lead you through the guidance of our respected uh, headmistress kairavina and uh, all the english teachers of this school including me and uh, i must mention uh, the tireless work of teacher dev who made this inaugural function in such a beautiful manner and in the lp section we have teacher sajana to guide you through and uh, other teachers as well so dear friends make use of this golden opportunity unleash your talents through this wonderful platform our wide up english club i wishing you all the very best for that thank you all thank you sir thank you the small word yet it speaks volumes and volumes of hidden sentiments of gratitude now let's move on to the theater of life here comes fifth d and fifth e team with a play portraying the importance of english adudev was sitting at his home his mother speaking to his english teacher on the phone His English teacher was most probably calling to complain about Aditya's poor marks that he scored. Hello, I am Aditya's English teacher. He scored very poor marks in English. Hello, Mashe, onnu Malayalathil parayamo. Nangalkku English ariyilla. Aditya's English il valare mosha mark aanu levichu. Ningal avane nannai അവനിക്ക് മറ്റു വിഷയങ്ങളിലൊക്കെ നല്ല മാർക്കുണ്ട് കേരളത്തിൽ ജീവിക്കാനുള്ളത് കൊണ്ട് തന്നെ ഇംഗ്ലീഷ് അറിഞ്ഞില്ലെങ്കിലും കുഴപ്പമൊന്നും ഉണ്ടാവില്ലല്ലോ എന്നാലും ഞാൻ ഇനി അവനെ ശ്രദ്ധിക്കാം എന്താണ് 
അത് ഞാൻ പിന്നെ പറഞ്ഞു തരാം നീ പോയി ആ പരിസര പഠനവും മലയാളമോ വായിക്കു Adidev's father has come from the office with his manager's daughter. She is doing her education from abroad and she doesn't know Malayalam. This is my manager. I'm going to talk about this. 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 സ്റ്റഡീസ് Adidev is calling her to help him to understand Pragya's language. Hey Nivedia, onnu ivide vare varumo? Endha Adi? Idenda achanne manager ude kuttiyana. Ivalku malayalam ariyilla. Ivalu parayunna onnu enikku manasilagunnilla. Nee onnu chodikumo? Hey I know. What did you ask to them? Can I have some water please? ഇവർക്ക് them we are also eagerly waiting for the fest may i invite master nivet to propose the vote of thanks good morning i feel indeed proud to be given this opportunity to propose the vote of thanks on behalf of the school let me extend my sincere gratitude to our chief guest mrs supladatta who spared her valuable time to grace this event Thank you ma'am. Let me now thank our respected teacher Mrs. Kairali ma'am who is the backbone of our school for giving us this opportunity. Thank you ma'am. I am immensely thankful to all my teachers who put their effort in making this event a great success. Our sincere gratitude goes to all parents for your support and encouragement. Last but not least 
thank to all the students and my dear friends for showing their interest in the program thank you one and all with this we come to the end of our program